I told you and taught you this over and over again, that don't say that I don't care about people's drama and this is their business and I do not care. No, this is wrong. You are the one who put yourself in a place where people are talking about you. You are sitting for, uh, let me give you an example. You are considered to be the Imam of the Masjid. You are someone who is uh, uh, pious. They think about you as a righteous man. And you're sitting in a shisha with people that are smoking shisha. Or you, be, be, or you are, they take a video of you and you're sitting next to people that are smoking cigarettes. You put yourself in a place where people are going to say, why is he sitting with these people? Are these his friends? Are they, right? You're putting yourself in a suspicious place at a suspicious matter. You have a channel or you have a school, a madrasa, and you bring somebody that there are question marks about, uh, question marks about him and serious ones, correct ones. You need to justify. You need to show. You go and sit with it is even worse, by the way. This is worse. Or you go and sit with the people of Bid'ah and the people of Ahwa and you say, I do not care. I'm going to sit with them. And people see you. Not that you are doing this for the sake of da'wah or you are doing this once and it is a da'wah and you're teaching tawheed and you're showing that. No, we're talking about that you're going and sitting with them, eating with them, sitting with them. Not to give as well private advice. You're always seen there. Not that you went once to give private advice or so. No, you're always there. These are the people that, that you sit with. These are the people that are around you. No. Or you show them to be that they are the, 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 the Salafis. And you say this is a maslaha and mafsada. We say, no. You're putting yourself in a suspicious matter. And you never justify. And you never justify. You understand? Barakallahu feekum. You just do it and you never just, and then you say, ah, oh, people are going to speak. Some people are going to backbite. These are slanderers. No, look over and over. Sheikh Bakr, Abu Zaid, Sheikh bin Uthaymeen, Sheikh bin Baz, Sheikh Abdullah al-Bassam. They keep teaching us this. Every time we open a book, we get this. Don't put yourself in a suspicious matter. Don't put yourself in a suspicious matter. This is not the hadith, the way of the messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. This hadith, we can use this hadith as well. Not just the hadith of our mother, Safiya. This hadith as well. هل كان فيها وثن يعبد؟ هل كان فيها عيد من عياد؟ The Messenger صلى الله عليه وسلم is doing what? Is making istifsal. He's asking, why is this? So that you are not considered to be like them. You're not considered to be amongst these people. So don't put yourself in a position where you're gonna, people are going to take you in light of that there is a question mark upon you. You're not justifying. You're not showing your place. You are with the people of Bid'ah. Why did you appear with them? You are with the people of Ahwa. Why did you appear with the people of Ahwa? You are. You appeared with people that are smoking cigarettes, or people that are in a shisha. You appeared with women that are uncovered. You are a, a mixed place. What you're making women laugh. You're making. You understand. You're putting a shubha. There is a suspicious matter. You appeared with actresses. With what? Why? People, don't come and say. I do not care. You don't know what's in my heart. So you're doing it publicly. It's not about people can reply to you publicly and ask for clarification publicly or even reply to you, even refute you publicly because you're doing this publicly. Aywa, this tamir is not acceptable. And we have mashayikh and fudala that reply to people who do this. Tayyib. 